Hi everyone and welcome to our new Tampa Tech Teaching Studio. Hopefully we'll see a lot more of each other here. So the aim is to discuss a huge range of topics where we can build on different opportunities for these tamper evident solutions. So it's been a while. The last video we did was all about our food delivery labels and this is definitely something that we'll be covering much more on over the coming months. So if you've got any ideas or specifics of what you'd like us to cover, please do get in touch. So in today's video we're going to be talking about pallets. So with high value or genuine uh, goods as the products on the pallets and then why they should no longer be just being shipped in the same way that bags of compost are with some simple pallet wrap and maybe a bit of banding. Pallets should be secured with either a tamper evident label or a security tape acting as a key irreversible identifier to speed up the shipping process and provide confidence and moreover protection to both the brands and the consumers that the goods are genuine. So I was speaking to one of our partners a few weeks ago about a pallet that had gone missing for an end customer. He was explaining that it was going to be impossible to see if anything had happened to the goods even now that they'd found the pallet because let's face it anyone can unwrap a pallet, swap or tamper with the goods and then re-wrap it so it looks like nothing's happened. So this person and his company then had to support their customer by ordering another pallet of the product from the warehouse in order to buy time to go through the stolen one and attempt to establish what had happened to it. So of course this then led to reduced profits, time and money burning away and frustration for his customer which isn't what any of us want. So I can't dive in too much as to the goods on the pallet but this is a great opportunity for you to put in your or your customer's goods to this real world example and bring it to life. So from phones to pills and trainers to genuine service parts we've got to protect our customers. When he got the pallet back to him, he started looking at the wrapping and slowly opened it up. He realised that the problem was that he could feel the pallet wrap was different to what it had uh, been wrapped in originally because just it, it was just from the thickness. And then when he got the, to the boxes, he'd just got plain clear tape sealing them. They looked a bit worse for wear, but based on the current shipping environment, that wasn't much of a surprise. So it was very hard to tell if anything had happened. Naturally then he started to go through box by box and found that some boxes didn't have the quantity of items in as what he had shipped and then some were just swapped for completely fake packaging. So when we talk about tamper evidence I really want to share that there are always so many choices and that's why conversation is so important. So depending on the scale of the potential or current challenges, the cost of the problems, the budget constraints, the brand image etc, we can customise the solution to ensure it's most appropriate for the business. So first we want to talk about securing the cartons. The tape they used in this example is just a normal 50mm wide clear packaging tape. The problem is everyone can get hold of it and in reality even if it was printed on top with a logo it's now so so easy to get this done that it can be copied without delaying the theft. There are some options on our security tape starting at roll length and width. Widths can be changed depending on application to support uh, the cost and the roll length can be up to 500 metres a roll for an automatic case sealing machine or 50 metres a roll for a hand tape gun. The tape then replaces the standard tape to provide immediate security. So some of the things we do to ensure immediate protection is provided. The first thing is a security void message. This is the permanent transfer of a message onto your choice of carton when the tape is pulled. So of course this can be customised, it can say literally anything you want, a picture, QR code, etc. So then we've got custom surface or subsurface print, subsurface sequential numbers with prefixes or suffixes, subsurface barcodes and or QR codes or data matrixes linking to websites for marketing campaigns or numbering or whatever you want it to link to basically. The void is still going to work well below minus 50 degrees, so it's perfect for those cold chain environments as well. Custom logos and text designs. And then we've got additional security features on top of all that, from UV ink to security cuts and so much more. So we must also touch on the fact that not all of the goods that this guy ships are high value. So sometimes the need and importance of ensuring that we can see non-tampered goods isn't as high, and this is also fine. So those cartons can be left sealed with plain tape. It's just about working how much the right security tape will support you and save you in lost time, upset customers and uncertainty, which as I've just explained is exactly all the three things that my partner got. So when we then come back to the outer layer, back to the pallet wrap, 
We all use this, it's a great tool, and one thing that we're finding now is a lot of pallets are being stopped at the borders and checked that the goods are still what the shipper shipped. The pallets that cannot be immediately authenticated are then being put to the side and the checking process begins. But the pallets that are still clearly genuine are being cleared straight away and their journey continues. So again here, this is where we come back to choices. So the first choice here is that we can secure straight onto the pallet wrap. So with crate or pallet security tape, this again can be any width and length from 27mm wide and as low as 20 meters per roll. And this will allow just one roll of tape to be used per pallet, making the standard operating procedure extremely easy to implement. Because you know that when you've used the right amount of tape, when there's none left on the roll. So again, widths and lengths of rolls can be tailored to suit the specific needs. This process will effectively stop the pallet from being stolen because it's going to be far too obvious that the pallet has been compromised if it's rewrapped and then the security tape is non-existent. So therefore, someone else's pallet without security tape on is going to be picked on. So the next stage for speeding up the clearance process is using a numbered security label that is again fixed to the outside of the pallet wrap with a dual number tab that's fixed to the paperwork. So it's like a bolt seal on containers, but for pallets. So this way, your pallet is tied to your paperwork like never before. So if the label on your pallet wrap is attempted to be pulled off, again, immediately it'll show the security void message to deter any pilfering. So after this, we discuss the different options and immediately put into place the security tape on the pallet wrap and the labels with the numbering uh, to be matching the pallets and the paperwork together. And he hasn't seen another problem since. So this shows that a simple solution can help an ongoing problem and actually it was an immediate effect that it had. So the investment in the packing right out to the pallet wrap on the outside has saved my customer more hours and costs since that would have otherwise been spent sorting out these problems rather than driving the business forward. So hopefully this story that I've shared today has brought to life a real problem in so many industries. So I just wanted to share with you some uh, key data just to again bring it to life even more. So in the fashion industry, £3.1 billion worth of fake garments and accessories were imported into the UK in 2016 alone, so imagine what that is now. Footwear fakes are a $12 billion industry every single year. The pharmaceutical counterfeit industry is now worth over $200 billion. The pet food market overall is worth over 86 billion and just imagine how much of that is counterfeit based on what we've just discovered. With this, we can support and provide a very quick, robust solution to support you and your customers. So I just wanted to circle back. Today's takeaway is pallets with high value or genuine products should no longer be being shipped in the same way that bags of compost are with some simple pallet wrap and clear tape. Boxes and pallets should be secured with either a tamper evident label or security tape to speed up the shipping process and to provide confidence and moreover protection to both brands and consumers that their goods really are genuine. So thanks for listening today and please do get in touch if you'd like to talk further and I'll see you guys again soon.